a 200 bus system is given and it is required to find the minimum number of equations to be solved by Newton Epson method in polar coordinate. We know that the minimum number of simultaneous equations to be solved by Newton Epson method in polar coordinate or the size of Jacobian matrix will be equal to the number of unknown bus voltage variables present in the system. In the problem, the, quest, uh, the system is of 200 bus. Among 200 buses, it is said that 160 buses are PQ buses. So, we can find the number of unknown bus voltage variables. The system given in the problem has 200 buses. So, we know that at any bus of the system, there are two voltage variables. One is magnitude of voltage and other is phase of voltage. So, at any bus, two bus voltage variables are present. So, for 200 bus, total number of, total number of voltage variables will be 200 into 2. If we subtract total number of known bus voltage variables from this total number of voltage variables, we can calculate the total number of unknown bus voltage variables. So, we have this total number of bus voltage variables for this 200 bus system. We have to subtract the known bus voltage variables and we can find the number of unknown bus voltage variables. For this system, it is said that out of 200 buses, 160 buses are PQ buses and remaining 40 buses have the generators connected to it. It is not said but it is understood that the remaining 40 buses has generators connected to it. It means that to find the unknown bus voltage variables, we know that this is total number of bus voltage variables out of 40 PV buses, one have to be taken as slack bus of the system at and at the slack bus of the system, both voltage variables are known. So, we will subtract 2. This is for slack bus present in the system. And remaining 39 PV buses, we have remaining 39 PV buses, we have 1 voltage variables mod V known at each bus. So, we will subtract 39 from this total number of voltage variables, we can calculate the uh, unknown bus voltage variables equal to this 200 into 2 minus 2 for the slack bus and 39 for the PV buses present in the system. This is total number of voltage variables. This is for slack bus and this is for PV bus. So, the minimum number of equations to be solved, the minimum number of equations to be solved or the size of Jacobian matrix which is equal to the number of unknown bus voltage variable will be equal to this which is which is simply 359. So, we will have to solve 359 simultaneous equations to find 359 unknown bus voltage variables in Newton-Epson method.